welcome to my channel and this is my first video on my channel if you guys haven't noticed yet so yep but I think we should get started with your little introduction first because you guys probably do not know who I'm at all so yep let's get on with that so my name is Megan I'm 14 years old and I come from Singapore so I know I don't look like I'm 14, but trust me, I am. I'm turning 14 this year, so, yep. So anyways, it is the holidays in Singapore now, so I just went to Hong Kong last week, and I think you guys can tell by the title of this video, but this video will be about my squishy haul that I got from Hong Kong, and I'll leave the address where I got my squishies in Hong Kong down below in the description box, so, yep. But let me just say, Hong Kong really is a squishy paradise. So, yeah. But without further ado, let's get on with the haul. So first, I'm going to start off with my Comet Squishies. First, I have this Dragon Squishy. And I got this as a free gift, which is really nice. And this is actually the shop. The shop is a couple of boxes. Okay. And they have an Instagram, I believe. So, yeah, you see that. So, yeah, I have that. Next, I have this wine gift, which I just got from the night market. And this is actually really soft and slurring, and I really like it. Some of you guys can't see because the lighting is not the best now, so yeah. Next, I have this pink Happy Barson biscuit. And you see that. It's pretty squishy and slurring, so yeah, I have that. Next, I have this Jogger Squishy, which I got from the Night Market too. And this was a bit pricey, but I just couldn't help it because it was my first Jogger Squishy. And the shading at the back is actually really nice, in my opinion. So, last but not least, for my common squishies, I have this Replica Healthy Donut Strawberry Frosting with Sprinkles. And this is actually really soft and suarizing. And I got this as a stress earlier because it was really cheap. So, yep, I have that. So now I'm moving on to my licensed squishies with the like tags on top of them. So, so first I have this Cafe DN Cinnamon Roll Squishy and here's the tag. And it comes with this little acrylic tag here. Which one? It says Cafe DN. And it's really soft and slurizing. And here's the back. So yeah. I have that. Next, I have this Cafe DM cookie and here's the tag. It comes with the same tag and the same plastic Cafe DM charm. Sorry, it's not focusing, but it says Cafe DM. And this squishy is really thin, so it's not like super slurizing, but it's still pretty soft and slurizing for such a thin squishy, in my opinion. So, yeah, but here's just the back. So, yeah, and the two Cafe Idea Squishies, really awesome, I really recommend. Next, I have this new Sammy Donut, and it has, like, rainbow pastel frosting, and it comes with the normal Sammy tag, and it's pretty slurizing. And I must say, Cafe Idea and Sammy have really stepped up their game. Next squishy I have is this... Hello Kitty Cake Roll, and I believe this is pretty rare right now, and this is the vanilla one, so this is the tag. And it has a yellow sticker at the back, and this sticker here. And I don't know, but I think this is pretty rare now. It's pretty dense, not very sliding, but still, it's a bit sliding, I guess. So, yeah, I have that. Next up, we're moving on to the slurizing license squishy, so yeah. First, I have this Oily Alarm Clock Squishy, and disclaimer, I will not be taking most of these out of packaging, I'm sorry, but I really don't want the packaging seal to not be sticky, but this squishy is really slurizing actually, and it's very soft, and the packaging is really cute, and it says Alarm Clock, and you see back, sorry if you guys can't really see, because how are we not focusing, because I'm filming with my phone right now, and let's just say it's not the best. But I'm changing my phone soon, so. Anyway, next I got this Squishy Factory ice cream, and this is in the cow design. And both my mom and I find this design very cute, so yeah. This squishy is super slow rising. 
it's really soft too. But I want to get out of packaging and it was very sticky. So I don't want to take it out of packaging anymore. But you guys can see how wrinkly it is, even though I'm squishing it in the packaging. So yeah. Let's get back at the packaging. So yep, yeah, I have next I have this Hebrew zip block chocolate, I think. Um this actually smells like real chocolate. It smells like a mixture of real chocolate with soap, which smells really good. And I don't know if you can tell, but it says good luck, and you probably can't. I'm really sorry for the glare over there. Lighting is just not good right now, so, yeah. But anyways, it's really squishy, I'm sorry I I know you guys probably can't see me. Oh, I'm so sorry. But I don't know if you guys can see the wrinkles. Um, yeah. So, and here's the back of the packaging. So, yeah. Next, I have this Aridi pudding, I think. And this is the um, one with the yellow one on top. There's also one with red on top. It's really squishy and solarizing, of course. I mean, nowadays it's like common for squishy to be solarizing. And it comes with a face, which is really cute. And this is squishy. And the back of the squishy. So, yep, I have that. Next squishy I have is the Squishy Fun Peas in a Pot Squishy. Disclaimer this smells really good. It smells like a melon. And not artificial melon, actually, it smells like real legit melon. So, yep. This is really cute, and sorry about that. Um, yeah. Uh, this is kind of tall, so I'm just gonna add it. And you should be able to see this one properly, I guess. Like, can you see the wrinkles? And, um, because this squishy is really tall. Packaging is actually really crisp, but look at how tall it is. It's like as almost as tall as my head. So, yeah, but here's the back of the packaging. Let me just squish these up here. Yeah, but this is a really sorry and squishy. And I believe I got it for only, like, I think it was only, like, 11 or 12 SGD. Like, that's super cheap. It's, like, 9 USD. And for such a good quality squishy, it's really worth it, in my opinion. So, yeah. Next squishy I have is the Santi Eon Toast. And it's a pink toast. And I know it's upside down, but I don't really care because I got this as a free gift too from the same shop that gave me the Dragon Fruit Squishy as a free gift. They're super awesome, guys. You have to go check them out. They're so generous. They used to give out fidget spinners for free if you purchased over 100 HKD, which is like 20 USD or even less, depending on the exchange rate. But yeah, just like they gave me the squishy for free, and it's like so soft. I don't even tell, but. It's really soft and it's really slurizing too. Like, I don't know. I don't know how to squish it to show you guys. Like, I'm sorry. I've never made squishy videos like this before. Like, I'm, I know you're supposed to like squish it at the side, but I don't know how. Um, okay, that's a fail. You guys probably cannot do that. But yeah, it's just super soft and slurizing. And I just love it a lot. So let me try one more time. Yeah, I think like this is better. It's actually really surprising for such a thin squishy, in my opinion. So, yeah, and they gave it to me for free. I cannot believe. Next, I have this Jumbo Squishy Fun Steam Bun. And the Jumbo Fun Steam Bun. It's super squishy and surprising, and it's really big. Like, look at it compared to my face. It's almost as big as my face. But yeah, it's super squishy and surprising. You see back, and there is a typo. It it says Stwampun instead of Steam but I don't really mind since I got it for like 8 USD or 9 USD. Next squishy I have is this Jumbo Squishy Fun Pink Bunny Cake. And this is really big, like it's bigger than my face. So, uh, of course, it is super squishy and slower, I think, as we were all expecting, right? And this one doesn't have a typo. But here's the back of the packaging, and I just find it so cute! This is actually my number one favorite squishy that I bought on this trip, actually. So, yeah. Next squishy I have is this Santi Elon Sushi Squishy. And I actually got two of these. One for my friend. 
and one for myself. But yeah, I gave it to her already. But it's practically the same squishy. I just and I even bought it from the same channel. They were selling this for super cheap, like two or three SGD. It's actually pretty squishy and similar, I think. Just be fast. So yeah. Next squishy that I have is this jumbo already pink monkey pink squishy. And here it is. It's really squishy and sorry, and I believe I got this for around 12 SG. And it even has pipe frosting at the sides to make it look realistic. Super cool in my opinion. And super high quality. Just keep back. Super sorizing, of course, because it's by Aridi. So, yeah, I think we all know that already. Next squishy I actually have never seen before. It is this, I, think, I believe it's a really new one, but it is this Jumbo Kibu Cream Cake Squishy. Oh, this is so nice. That's like my dream beater, okay? Don't judge. But I love sweet treats, so. Yeah, um, this is actually really thick, and the packaging is really pretty. It's really soft and slurizing, and I love it a lot. So, yep. I have that. Sorry if I'm very being really cringy, because I probably am. The second last squishy I got is this boo boo the cuss. <laughs> Sorry, I just end up cracking up every single time I say the name, but what was the last one you gave name Boo Boo the Cloud? That's so cute. It's a cloud! Oh my god, I cannot believe somebody actually made a cloud squishy. I've been wanting the squishy ever since I saw it come out, and I was like, oh dear, I have to get it. I was so happy when I got it, when I saw it in Hong Kong, that I just couldn't help it. I had to buy it. So, yeah, it's really soft and slurizing too. So, yeah, here's the back of the packaging. It's really cam up in it, and it smells really nice, like fruits, I guess. So, yeah, fruit punch me. Last squishy I have is this Jumbo Lady Squishy. Um, I don't like how, but it's really soft and sorry. But, I'll take this one out of packaging, because you guys probably cannot see this very well in the packaging. So, it is this Jumbo Lady Raccoon Burner, and this is the pink one. They only have one pink one left in stock, I'm so happy, because I want a pink one instead of the orange one. Most of those that had in stock left were orange, though. Uh, of course, it's super squishy and slurizing. Here's the raccoon. And here's the back. It has Lele licensing. You guys probably can't see that, but it says Lele over here. So, yep. And I just love this so much. This was a little bit pricey to get. Here's the packaging. It says Lele Squishy. Back. So, yep, I have it. So that's it for my video, guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed and please like share and subscribe the big red button is down below you can't miss it and i'd really appreciate your support and your support would really mean a lot to me so yeah i'll try to post videos more often now it's holidays in singapore so yeah but anyways that's it for this video guys and i hope you guys enjoyed by the way my instagram will be linked down below in the description box so you guys should go check it out if you want but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and yeah bye so my name is Megan, I'm 14 years old, and I come from Singapore, so I know I don't look like I'm 14, but trust me, I am, I'm turning 14 this year, so, yep. So anyways, it is the holidays in Singapore now, so I just went to Hong Kong last week, and I think you guys can tell by the title of this video, but this video will be about my squishy haul that I got from Hong Kong and I'll leave the address where I got my squishies in Hong Kong down below in the description box so yep but let me just say Hong Kong really is a squishy paradise so yeah but without further ado let's get on with the haul so first I'm gonna start off with my comet squishies first I have this dragon squishy, and I got this as a free gift which is really nice and this is actually the shop the shop is a couple of boxes Okay, and they have an Instagram, I believe so. Yep, you see that. So, yep, I have that. Next, I have this wine gift, which I just got from the night market. And this is actually really soft and slurizing, and I really like it. Some of you guys can't see because the lighting is not the best now, so, yep. 